Penelope's Closet is open Tuesdays through Saturdays from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Proceeds go straight to Penelope House. The shelter also has a wish list online, and you can find a link to the Penelope House website through our website, local15tv.com. Well, one story that had many of you talking this past year was a story we brought you last month. It's about a tunnel under Foley's old Magnolia Inn. Well, now that inn, tunnel included, is for sale. That new order, that new owner rather, needs to have a sense of history and of romance. Local 15's Darwin Singleton explains. The men like that. When Foley businesswoman and philanthropist Margie Snook looks at the Magnolia Inn, she's overwhelmed with emotion. Her thoughts go back to the days when the inn was known as the Magnolia Hotel, the place where she and the late John Snook met as he strolled past her on the porch of the old inn. And I was with my mother. And I saw this man come by, and he tipped his hat. And I thought, oh, that's a gentleman there. Well, she married that gentleman, who became one of the two loves of her life. The second was the hotel itself, which she eventually bought, converted to a plush bed and breakfast, and renamed the Magnolia Inn, a business she successfully ran for several years. But now Margie Snook is ready to share this experience with the next couple that could fall in love with the old Magnolia Inn. That's right, the Magnolia Inn is for sale. We are standing in the main ballroom of the Magnolia Hotel. Tom Stanton is very close to Aunt Margie, as he calls her. He and his exit realty company are hoping to find just the right buyer for the Magnolia Inn. It is a bed and breakfast. It is, as a matter of fact, it's the largest one in the state of Alabama. It has 10 bedrooms and 10 full baths. And it's ready to go. It's ready to go, fully furnished with the antiques that Miss Snook looked all over the all over the country for, and uh, it's a beautiful home. The price tag, two million dollars, and that includes the ballroom, dining area, and pool just off the deck. The new owner will also be buying a piece of history that dates back to 1908, when the Magnolia Hotel was literally the last stop on the line for people traveling south. The railroad station right across the street. It's where the railroads ended, right here. And there's something else. And of course the porches, I mean that's the biggest thing, the porch, the, the, the greatest place to sit and that's why Miss Nook originally bought it. She told her mama she wanted to sit on that porch and that's what the porches make the hotel. So, who might buy the old Magnolia Inn? Most likely someone who is much like Margie Snook, who connects with the property in a way that goes beyond dollars and cents and cuts straight to the heart. It's going to be a love thing. I mean, you, you think about it, Miss uh, um, Snook's mom and dad were married right here in this hotel. So it has lots of memories. It's the center of Foley. In Foley, I'm Darwin Singleton, Local 15 News. And along with the huge Hotel Magnolia for $2 million, you can also own the fully equipped restaurant and two ballrooms next door for an additional $3 million. There's even an attached corner building for sale. Exit Realty's Tom Stanton says give them a call if you're interested. That number 974-1288.